really tried to force the play when he had this shot. Uh, Adamo Quill thought that uh, Dunleavy was going to be there, and he wasn't. Those have all hurt him. Of course, he's got to continue the scoring as well. He gave him such a shot in the arm. Randolph against Murphy. Zito flips up the hook, and Golden State beats him.
Golden State with 20 turnovers, and the Blazers have turned those into 27 points. Randolph on the drive against Foyle. The jump hook. Long, Foyle the rebound. Antonio Daniels the steal and the save. Rob Woods can't corral it, and Foyle sends it to the front row. The Golden State over the last 10 days leads the NBA in scoring at 113 a game. That's their good news. The bad news is they allow 113 a game. And the Blazers have already surpassed that. Portland with a turnover. Welsh and Stoudemire messes that. Or he was behind the bucket that time. Dudley for three. Got none. Randolph the rebound. He thought he saw Daniels running, and it turned out that Daniels stopped. And then Damon commits the foul against Welsh. And Blazers over. I beg your pardon, it's their first foul in the last two minutes. Dunleavy against Antonio Daniels. Dunleavy and Faith in and out. Dunleavy, when these teams first met on December 20th, I interviewed him, and you could sense there was an element of frustration. He was not getting minutes. He was frustrated by that, but I think he was just as frustrated by his own inability to make shots as Zach Randolph scores. Well, you know, there are certain things you know you do well. One of the things he knows he, you know, and with the expectations being so high, what was being said, he is going to be the best player as uh, Zach Randolph was in fight. He's going to be the best player on the Warriors team. And uh, if you buy into that coming in, and then you run into Arenas, Richardson, uh, Davidson, 